there, everyone. Welcome to my reaction to Halo the Series Season 2, Episode 2, Sword, I think is what it's titled. And yes, I didn't react to Episode 1, and there is a good explanation for that. I, I already saw it. No, seriously, uh, I was invited by Paramount and the 405th Pacific Infantry to attend the Halo Season 2 premiere in Hollywood the day before it aired, and I was extremely grateful and had so much fun. So I actually got to watch Episode 1 with Pablo and the producer, Kiki Wolfkill, the 405th, my friends, and I didn't want to pass up on that opportunity just for reactions that most people aren't going to watch anyways, and I had so much fun. I'm really glad I went. I had such a great time. I loved the episode, especially that first half. I'm extremely grateful for Paramount and the 405th and Halo the series, of course, for inviting us. We had such a great time, and we really look forward to doing more fun things with you guys in the future. It really meant a lot as a Halo fan, as a community member. I cannot be more grateful, and like Master Chief, I feel very lucky. But with that explanation out of the way, let's jump in to Sword. Good afternoon. So where's she been? That's when you leave here. Is that a problem? I. Oh my I God, Halsey has her say. own little birds, just like oh, Varys. She's I'm a spider. Sure right. Tell me about him. The Ackerson. You'd like him. He's very nice. Damn, is she a flash clone? I need you to tell me. One job, flash clone. Ooh, plasma damage. Yep, that'll do it. Omega team. Ricky's dead. I know. I shot her myself. I know that. Now she thinks something's wrong with you, bro. Oh yeah, this new intro slaps. Straight fire. Now that's a good Halo intro. Oh my god, I love it. How'd she get here? Why, why is she just vibing? Your tax says otherwise. Why do I recognize this actor? Where do I recognize him from? Hey! Why is he pushing him? There was no need to push him. They weren't even in his way. <laughs> Great, she's in the trash compactor. 326-3827. Dear God, maybe if you followed OSHA protocols, this wouldn't have happened. Stop. Oh, I know that he played um uh in Black Lightning. It's nothing. You assholes. <laughs> At war your whole life. You know you can't do this forever. Spartans never die. They just go missing in action. You ever think about that? Dude, is that she gonna life? like train the Spartan threes? Life without all this. Spartans. That'd be a cool parallel. I was you once. You were great. Oh, he was a Spartan too. Oh, don't blow smoke up my ass. The augmentations blinded him. Absolutely no recollection of what you say you encountered on Sentry. Well, she did hit her head. At the end of the day, he's just a guy in a suit. Damn. Damn, she going. <laughs> Damn! Tell me Playing war games? Like. Damn! She got that leap! <sighs> Playing a 1v3? Look at those I reach ARs! <gasps> Damn! <laughs> Partners don't take fall damage. As we just saw. <laughs> Get up. Someone must be giving them to you. Damn, every single time she gets questioned about the guy or talks about the guy. Tell me about the man. Tell me the man. His name. <laughs> it's not funny, but at the same time. Because <laughs> then you'd know I wasn't one of you. I know we had a few days blind. I wanted I'd to be, be a Spartan. Spartan. No. Absolutely not, sir. And she's real. Solid. What is that? Are you using force healing? It's yours. Is he hitting him hitting her with talk no jutsu? Damn, they're gonna get hey. real embarrassed when they find out that's Master Chief. 
I mean, he has 117 on his. On, death like, ratio? I don't keep score. You just asked him what his KD was? How do you explain that? You were ambushed by the Covenant. How do you explain that? Because you should have killed me. I uh, didn't want to get glassed either. Doesn't get better. Just gets further away. That's a great line. But man, does Master Chief suck at making people feel better. At least he's real. The clones all described a nice man. Uh, it is Ackerson. There's only one person who could know about it. I assure you. Mm. Any resemblance is pure. Damn. Gotcha. Okay, so they are like in this prison type of cell or something. He's in the Oni black site. Mmm. Still there. Hello, Cortana. Hello, Colonel Ackerson. What? Is there anything else you would like to know about Dr. Halsey? Mm. It's like a different version we'll of Cortana. There's a 97% probability. Oh. That's great. Meridian Relay. Standard crew rotation. Meridian. Eridani system. Ooh. So Let's reach. <laughs> Visegrad, is it gonna be Visegrad? All sign associated with this flight. Visegrad, <laughs> yo! <laughs> Noble team should be going there. The Covenant's on reach. Oh, <laughs> the chills, dude. <laughs> the Covenant's on reach. No, don't go in there. You fools. Oh, they're gone. Rip. Yeah, just stay back and send your men to die. Ooh. I would go up that ladder if I were you, man. Okay, you did not have time. Hey, RV. I know that's not Thel. It's the Arbiter before Thel got him. How is she alive? There you all go. There is my episode two reaction to Halo season two. This is starting to really feel like Halo. Definitely a step in the right direction. I'm very happy with what the showrunner has been doing. And after hearing him talk at that premiere, he is a fan of Halo. He does come across as someone who wants to shift this show into a direction in which the fans and the community want, but he also can't just ignore and wipe clean everything that happened in season one. So he's stepping in and having the hard job to pivot the show while also not retconning everything that came before. And I think episode two and especially episode one did a really good job at just really driving the narrative towards where it should have been going in the first place. And although I did enjoy season one as a show, to me, it's not a great Halo show, but season two is definitely a great show and starting to see, it's starting to seem like a great Halo show. And I love that line, the Covenant's on Reach. It's very reminiscent of Halo Reach. I love that they mentioned Visegrad. That's such a cool callback. And I'm excited to see how episode three tackles that. And I can watch it right now, so I'm not gonna spend much time theorizing it. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all at Visegrad. Subscribe to Zang Helios for some more un-freaking-believable content.